I have always said the brains beat brawn. I have literally found the best way to get powerful inside of this game. I am not joking when I tell you that today we may become the most powerful characters on the face of the planet. And using this ultimate strategy that I am going to share with you, you may too become a powerful cactus. Now, Hasty Games are back at it again with a brand new update, guys. And inside of this update, they now have freaky dinosaur women. No, but what they do have, guys, is a ton of amazing new pets for us to open up and also a load of other cool things, including new classes, new auras, and blah, blah, blah. But guys, using the brand new crafting menu underneath the pet selection right here, you can now take a normal pet and turn them all the way up into a rainbow pet, basically making yourself incredibly powerful. So as you can see right here inside of my inventory, I have a normal pet, which is a CC bot. These are the stats. And I have a golden version of the pet. And again, the stats get even better. And I even have the shiny version of the pet. And yet again, the stats are even better. Guys, I haven't quite managed to get myself a rainbow yet. But you can see what the uh, multipliers do. So doing a bit of quick math. We can assume that a rainbow pet will give you times 20 crowns. And like times 11 muscle and coins. Which is pretty impressive. Now for those of you that aren't aware of... Of how much having pets impacts how much you can swing i'm going to remove the four pets i currently have equipped and we're going to test to see what it is like when i have no pets so without any pets equipped using a pretty decent saber i get 589 trillion per swing now doing the exact same thing with four shiny cc bots i get 3.8 quintillion swing and guys this theory is bulletproof this is definitely the easiest way to become the most powerful player in the game don't worry about auras. Don't worry about sabers. They're for flipping randies. Today, we are focusing on the crafting aspect of this game. And guys, let me tell you something. I have noticed there are non-believers. Wait, what's this? I don't believe you? What? She is a non-believer. We must eliminate the non-believers. Ah! That is what you get for not believing in the ultimate theory. Guys, I need some sort of assistance. I cannot open any decent eggs. And the only person to have done it is Dolly. Dolly, king of the bubblegum realm and queen of the candy people. I need your guidance, oh great one. Tell me the way to become the greatest saber warrior of all time. Oh, wait a minute, guys. I, I think she might be frozen or something. Wake up! Oh my goodness, she's definitely frozen or broken at least. Bubble trouble? Oh wait, she's not asleep! Run! No! What did she do to me? <laughs> what the heck just happened? I folded like a flipping taco. Listen, Skylar, if you follow my program, you will become a hero. People will speak your name for years in the history books. Why don't you understand that, Skylar? Why won't you talk to me? Wait, what's this? Callie over here? Wait. Skylar? How come is there two of you? I'm so confused. She said over he he? Uh, that's a you. No, Skylar, that's you. You look like a flipping Randy. Anyway, guys, I need to stop messing about. No wonder why Dolly's got so many better pets than me. Look, she's literally got flipping shiny Blinkos and a shiny rainbow CC bot. Oh my goodness, I really do suck at this game. So, it is time for me to begin hatching and eventually I will become just as powerful as her and I can finally show off myself my very own rainbow CC bot. And so guys, I spent the next one whole hour hatching eggs and deleting pets until I finally decided to hatch myself a great idea. Why don't I just use my auto hatch game pass and AFK my game overnight? That way I can literally hatch a ton of pets and let the game do all the hard work. And so guys, that is exactly what I did. I left my game hatching overnight knowing that when I would return, I would find myself an inventory full of powerful pets. Um... It's the next morning. I AFK'd overnight to see how many pets I would be able to get, but disaster struck. I managed to die within the first 20 minutes of going AFK, which means I have literally been standing in the middle of my server all night doing nothing. Yeah, 
Let that one sink in. So, uh, <laughs> that plan didn't work, and Dolly's been here the whole time since, and has managed to get herself even more shiny Blinkos. Guys, we will persist. I am going to be opening these eggs now until I get one of three things. Either the best pet in the game, second option would be to get a shiny second best pet in the game, and the third option would be to get myself a Rainbow CC bot, aka the third best pet in the game. Having just one of the following pets will be an immense advantage of me growing fast in this game. It's kind of like putting steroids in milk. Guys, I should also mention roughly where I am in the game right now. I am not swinging my saber, but if I was, I would be growing exponentially fast. I'm currently right now a dark ninja, and for me to get the next class, it's 500 non Ozillion. And I'm currently at 87 Ozillion, so it shouldn't take too much longer. So I guess now I just AFK grind and swing my saber. Wait, what? Hey, Callie, have this Cheeto. Why is she adding me a Cheeto? Thank you so much. Okay, I'm eating the Cheeto. <laughs> what the flip? That was so random. It's poison? <gasps> Guys, I think I'm gonna die from a poison Cheeto. Help! Again, I am now hatching eggs, and I have been hatching for so long. I have defeated bosses. I have been swinging my saber. I should soon be able to upgrade myself to the next class. Okay, so once you've got yourself a pretty powerful team, guys, just like I have the shiny CC bots, that's all you need to do, guys. It's quite simple. You then need to start swinging your saber like you normally would, but you will be at an accelerated rate because of the fact that you have literally just made yourself so powerful so instead of swinging like a fifth of what it would be i am swinging an alarming number right now guys the next thing you need to do is tiptoe in your new merch followed by going to find a bully and giving him the left right good night okay guys as you can see within like five to ten minutes i have gone from being a dark ninja now to a warlock now when you first start off i do have a vip giving me a saber and i also have unlimited strength guys so when i swing straight away i'm already earning 4.69 billion on my first swing which is like a lot to earn on your first swing but as soon as i sell i am able to quickly buy straight away into the next amount just like this and as you can see guys right now i am uh literally like halfway down oh my whoa I made it all the way to the Sparkles Blade. Meaning I now get 92.7 quintillion. This is insane. So what I will do is just hatch eggs and swing, guys. This is the ultimate strategy. If you can swing and hatch eggs at the same time, you are set for life. Guys, literally all I gotta do is just keep clicking away. And I am going to get insanely powerful. Remember to take little intervals as well. That way you can keep upgrading your saber i'm probably gonna be like right the way down now like we've gone from there all the way down to here guys the tri venom blade i don't get to try you should try and brush your teeth as saying your teeth are super yellow oh my goodness they look like sweet corn we are in a new territory right now ladies and gentlemen we have just gone into the quad red blade I meaning we are getting powerful way too quickly the next one for us to get is the overlord class and after that it is the demigod class guys i will be getting that in just a short amount of time but i am going to need a lot of flipping points for me to be able to become the next most powerful player what do you want grumpy look how grumpy this girl is guys she's always so grumpy Wait, what? You can't dance here! I told you before! No dancing! Isn't that right, Rami Dino? Wait, Rami Dino? Rami, where did you come from? No, stop dancing, guys! Stop! Like I said, the way to become super powerful, just to recap, is to now make yourself the ultimate pets using the crafting available option. As you can see, I have got myself a ton of golden and shiny CC bots. Once you turn them into rainbow, guys, they will look like a dolly's one she has just around the back here as you can see it is literally changing color every few seconds and guys let me tell you something if you have those that is how you get to be number three on the leaderboard guys by being that powerful guys there she is dolly p 1980 and if you look above her name dolly p 1980 she is the one that told me this method and trust me it works she is the proof in the pudding damn 
But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please do hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? Alternatively, leave a comment or a suggestion in the comment section down below. And I, of course, will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.